here. Let's look around. Ah, treasure! Out of rust. Twelve gill. This area is called Horizon's Cusp. What is this floor design? Nothing. All right, we'll run and check the walls here. Floor 50. No more treasure. Okay. Let's go. Let's have the waystone take us up. Up, up, and away. Second ascent. Reach of Diamond Law. The reach. We're at level 60 now. Oh, what do these things say? Ignorant child. Stop calling me ignorant. I can't help it. Of ignorance of feared. Rare is the power that can bind. Here alone such magics work. Uh, neath mingling of crisp dawn waters. Uh, okay. You who reach but cannot grasp in failure ever to wander. Be well prepared for what is to come. The writings heed. Do your materials be true? Err among the four you choose. What? I want to get to choose between four rewards? I don't know if that's actually true. That's how I took it. Altar of Wealth. Here, make of your wealth an offering. Hoard it in stanchless avarice. Surrender it, and then... And then, only then, path to tread. What do I have to do? Hang on, how much money do I have? 188,000 gil. 173. Is it gonna take some gil away or something? What if I just lose an item? Whoa. Okay, that door open. Wealth avails you not. A magic field falls over the party. Items? You can't use items. Uh... Monka S? Also a crystal over here. Altar of Steel. Here, make of your steel an offering. Own sharp in days before man's dawn. Surrender it only then, path to tread. So I basically won't be able to attack then, is what you're saying. Ledge says, welcome to the mechanic of this part of the tower. Oh boy, okay. So we're not gonna wanna activate all these at once. It's a bad idea. Cause then we won't be able to use items, won't be able to attack, won't be able to use magic. Whatever else it's going to prevent us to. So we'll probably just do one at a time, I guess. So as far as I know, let's loop around as well. There looks to be four separate areas. Ultra magics, yep. 
Surrender your magics. What's this one? Is it gonna be uh, techniques? Probably. It's probably techniques. Okay, so let's go by one at a time here. Apparently we can only advance through this uh, when we can't use items. So let's see what, what's in here. That means I should probably swap to uh, like a lot of magic users or something. Probably would be a good idea, actually. Well, I mean like at least like put Pinello in the party or something. How close are we to the leveling here? Vaughn is 39,000 away, 45,000. Uh, they're all very, very far, so... Let's get rid of Balthier and put Pinello in here. Because if we get, if we get hit with status ailments... Um, and we can't use items, then we're going to need to rely on spells. This floor is where changing your party around is good. As you have some members set up for some things being taken away. Yeah. I like that it's going to force me to to uh, swap the party around. So yeah. Uh, I think that's... Uh, I might have to adjust some gambits, but... Yeah, pretty much you're good here. Put that up there. Okay. Let's see how we go here. Again, this whole tower has been very interesting. Uh, this is the third and final section, I think. But everything's been pretty different in all three phases. Rare souls who accost tower and sky, you alone binding magic stir. You who worldly props are now denied, on your own selves must you rely. Bed of stores from harvest past. Can't use items. So wait a minute, is there anything in here? Okay, that goes up. Okay. Also, Pinello, I think we have a new staff for you. Ivory pole. Sweet. Yeah, there we go. Enjoy. Can't use items. Okay. Yikes. The first thing right out of the gate, and it's skeletons. Uh, anyone have Libra? Crusader C. <laughs> Dude, that thing is just parrying for days. So everything on this floor is weak to holy, it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of Ash. Put Bosch in here with his holy lance. To make it a little bit easier. Where is Redis at? What are you doing, dude? Redis. Just because you have two swords doesn't mean you can solo things on your own, bud. Ignorant child, by history's shadow blinded. Undying are we, magnificent beyond your knowing, worthy of your fear. Once our power did we wield, holding temporal sway over all things great and small. Du, 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 du. 
Uh, do I want to continue in here? Uh, yeah. I guess. Also, Vaughn, we need your dispel gambit back. Put it up. Dark bone. Crusaders. So, um, over the past few days, my my brother has been looking for another game to play. Um, and he's really been wanting Monster Hunter World. And so he went looking and uh, there's this website called Is There Any Deals? And it pretty much searches through some websites where you can purchase like video games off of. Um, and there was a site that had Monster Hunter World for like, I don't know, like 26 bucks or something. And so he bought it. But he hasn't played it yet because he's at work and, and all that stuff. But he's going to play it later on tonight. And uh, I don't know. That's that's a game. Monster Hunter World is, is a game that I've been a little bit interested in. Uh, I've never played a Monster Hunter game before. But um, I've heard nothing but good things about the uh, Monster Hunter World. So I don't know. I might, I might get that game. I don't think I would stream it. But... I am, I'm curious about Monster Hunter World. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Cause I, I need to make sure I'm playing games when I'm not streaming as well. Because for a while I've always been a part of like if I'm... If I'm playing a game, I, I should be streaming it. It's like, eh, you shouldn't be doing that all the time. That's a, that's a quick way to burn out, to be honest. But, um... Yeah, I don't know. Something that my brother and I can, can play together. Let's see. We got uh, a couple of things. We got a ring that we just picked up. What was it called? Was it an opal ring? Is that what we got? I think that... I don't know. We, we picked up something. Crown of Laurels. Light Armor 11. Ooh. Damn. Who should I put that on? Probably Balthier, probably. Uh, okay, so we've been checking the rooms. Traveling through here. A lot of, a lot of side rooms here. Hey, Pinello 47. Da, 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 da. It's like there's a lot like you have to check this whoa, what is this thing? Broom. Ow. Disable. Oh no. Uh What gets rid of disable? I can't use items. Uh yikes. You guys can still walk, right? Maybe it'll wear off. Oh my. Oh, this goes up more? Ugh, okay, well, I gotta go back and check the circle area then. Yeah, there it goes. Okay, it wore off. Oh my god. Uh, that apparently goes down somewhere. Okay. 
I'm gonna start getting a little confused now. We can go up, we can go down. These are areas that we haven't been to yet. Speed up the combat here. Fake wall? Dead end wall, okay. Let's check out the roundabout here. Is it possible to go all the way around? Yes. Also should have Libra up. We haven't seen any traps inside the tower itself, which is nice. Yeah, okay. So all these areas have more rooms. Oh my god. I've like already had it going through all those little rooms. That side. I was gonna say ignore that, but okay. Let's go down over here, and now we can either go down or we can go up. I want to check what's uh where the down area leads. Like, does that take us back down to the main area? Yeah, it does. So wait a minute. You're telling me. That all four of those choices lead up to the same exact level that I'm on right now. But it's basically just like, oh, do you want to go through with uh, not being able to use items, magic, physical attacks, techniques? Huh. It's really weird. Honestly, I feel like I picked the... I picked a bad one. I should I should go back down and pick techniques, but it's fine. Because items are, is more useful than techniques. But... So then I want to go up top then. Good job. Let's go up, see if this is like a brand new floor, and if it lets us choose uh, what we want to do, or if it's still items. Can't use items. Still can't use items, okay. Station of Suffering. Jeez. With how big this area is, and with there being a crystal in here, I, I guarantee you there's going to be like, come back later for a hunt or something. They'll probably put a hunt uh, inside this tower. Reaver A. Uh, I wonder if they got anything good to steal. It's also a level 50 enemy. Turn that on. God, I can't believe we're getting to level 50 enemies now. Block. Missed. Last chance. He has nothing to. He has nothing to steal. Like he has nothing to steal. Okay. Turn that thing off then. Oops. Oh, Lord.
I'm starting to feel a little fatigue from this place. Zeus Mace. Ah, Fool's Facade. It's like there's so many areas that you get to travel through that have these little rooms and... It's just like, why? Why do I need to go through so many rooms? We're all slowed. Uh, it led us here for nothing. There's nothing in here. There's there's no treasure at all, other than just those enemies that have now slowed me for all eternity. Is that really a place that is meant to be dealt with in one sitting? I guess so. But we're going for it. Hmm. Yeah, I can't get rid of slow unless... I use an item and I don't have an item. Asuna does not work on that, so... Ugh. Well, we'll just see how it goes. I don't... I think slow always stays. I don't think it goes away like immobilize or stop or whatever. Uh... Reaver B. You have haste, you can counter slow with haste that erases it, perhaps with the boots. Wait, what just happened? My slow's gone. All I had all I had was Pinello cast Libra and all of a sudden all of the slow goes away? Slow wore off, okay. So it does go away, okay. I was like, what? Does Libra get rid of slow? Uh, oh. Really? Freaking Redis. Redis stepped in the trap and murdered, and murdered me. Also, notice how, a f like a floor ago, I was talking about there's not, there hasn't been any traps. And here they are. Oh boy. That off there. Wow, two people leveled up there. Ancient door. Anything happen with opening said door or no? Oh, jeez. Yes, they put traps in the more annoying area of the map. Uh-oh. Annoying area confirmed. Hey, look, we can go upstairs. We can get out of this zone if we want. I do want to see what the circle looks like, though. Like, is there... Hmm. Also, I have no idea if there's any more... Uh, illusioned walls or not, but 
in this area. We'll see if this roundabout actually goes all the way around or not. If it does, then we're just gonna go up the steps. Push her here. Not of rust. Uh oh. Dragon Lich. Holy crap. Uh, okay, let's go for the Dragon Lich. Let's also see what uh, Vaughn can steal from it. God, I always go to freaking equipment when I want to do the Gambit thing. Fearga. I missed. Could not steal. Quick enough. Wow, 2000 XP, not bad. Solid horn. Uh, I will take that thing off. Wait, I just came back to where I was. Yep, they all have areas like this. They all have areas. I'll try that gambit off here after this fight. Okay, so let's just go back to where we found those steps that were going up and just go up. Because the floors are pretty much the same so far. I'm going to skip these guys. But we have gotten quite a few levels from uh, this area. I don't know if I would necessarily pick this area to grind in. But judging by the, the levels of enemies here, it probably is a good idea to pick this area to grind if I needed to. See where this leads. Ancient door. Still can't use items. Look at this. Look at our MP right now. Ah, Station of Ascension. So that's where we originally started. Then we went up one, then we went up another. Now we're at the third. Third section. I probably, well, I still need to use the spell, so. The only other way I think I get MP is if I if I use the charge technique. Just like a hit or miss type of thing. No, Vaughn, stop. Just attack this guy. Vaughn, please. Oh my god, we're dead here. That was actually a death trap. Okay, so that's out there. Duh. Treasure out here? Yes, there is. 
Okay, who has the charge technique? Only Pinello does. Worked. Alright, at least Pinello has that. Da -da 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 -da. The dead end with an enemy? Nope, no enemy. 35 kill. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna have to cross over. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna continue to stay on this side. As I've been doing the whole time that we've been going, coming up these last three levels. What is that thing walking around? Baroon. Uh, get that thing up here. I think we fought this already. They do like a... Uh, I think they do like petrify and crap like that. Or at least um, stop or slow or something like that. So it might be a good idea to put this stuff on. Not petrify, disable, immobilize. Was that the one that I was? I don't remember. I'll put one on each. Yeah, immune to stop. And we need to have that on for when we're checking chest. As far as grinding in this place, for levels, it's pretty okay for your level range. Yeah. Because we're, we're coming up on enemies that are like level 48, 50, 51. Uh, and our characters are like the mid 40s, pretty much. 